CD Projekt Red confirmed what many of us already suspected. The new Witcher teaser actually did reveal a new school. The School of the Lynx. So let's recap all the Witcher stuff that just happened in the last couple of days, because it was so much that my head is spinning. Will there be a new GTA? Will there be a new Elder Scrolls? A new Dragon Age? Some franchises are just destined to go on and on, unless the final chapter has been set. And this is the case with Uncharted, and even in the case of the latter. Who's to say we won't just get a new game with different protagonists? Hell, even God of War continued after its original trilogy, by essentially reinventing Kratos. With The Witcher only really achieving mainstream popularity of the highest order with The Witcher 3, you can bet your house and your mother's life insurance that The Witcher 4 is coming. In fact, it was just announced. For most of the world, the Witcher 3 was the first time they experienced that, so if anything the Witcher games are only really getting started. Is The Witcher 4 finally in the works? Though it hasn't officially been confirmed by CD Projekt Red yet, a job listing gave us everything we needed to know. CD Projekt Red is officially looking for someone with experience in developing real-time third-person perspective cameras. Since the only other games in CD Projekt Red stables is Cyberpunk, we can damn be sure that this is about The Witcher 4. Also, besides not even being a first-person game, Cyberpunk hasn't even released for the next-gen consoles yet. In fact, the next-gen release was delayed, so the production of a new Cyberpunk game is still ways away. Meanwhile, The Witcher 3 was released in 2015, and fans are itching for a new release. After 6 years, the timing seems about right, especially considering that we're still awaiting an announcement. The actual release could be well into 2025 or beyond, creating a 10-year gap between The Witcher 3 and The Witcher 4. Lastly, after the cyberpunk debacle, The Witcher is CD Projekt Red's saving grace, so they want to get back to their fans' good sides with The Witcher 4. Shouldn't The Witcher 4 be released by now? Well, The Witcher 3 was only released in 2015, and that's been 6 years. If we're expecting an announcement within the next WitcherCon, which should take place in mid-2020, then we're talking 6 years between announcements. From then on, add another 2 years until the actual release, and the gap between The Witcher 3 and The Witcher 4 is 8 years. If we look at other major franchises, then that is a fair time for development. Red Dead Redemption 2 and 1 were 8 years apart. The Last of Us 1 and 2 were 7 years apart. While Uncharted 3 and 4, GTA 5 were 5 years apart. With games getting bigger and bigger, and, expectation, and expectations of AAA games reaching an all-time high, developers are no longer in a rush, and even 10 plus years between major releases is possible. Just look at the release date for The Elder Scrolls 6. Will The Witcher 4 be revealed at WitcherCon? WitcherCon 2021 was slightly disappointing then and only had The Witcher 3 next gen release as its biggest announcement. So now all hopes are on WitcherCon 2022. Since the convention is set to take place sometime in mid-2022, we would say that a first reveal or announcement of The Witcher 4 is realistic. After all, what else is CD Projekt Red going to announce within The Witcher franchise? What else do you know CD Projekt Red is working on? As stated above, we know that they are currently working on bringing Cyberpunk 2077 to the Xbox Series X and S and the PlayStation 5. Also, The Witcher 3 is getting the same treatment, and it's being ported to the new consoles. These new versions were recently delayed, in order to assure quality. So we know that CD Projekt Red is busy with these games for the time being. What is The Witcher 4 about? Well, our guess is as good as yours. So we'll just point out towards the few tidbits that CD Projekt Red has given us. The first three Witches were by definition a trilogy, so we simply could not name the next game, The Witcher 4. This does not mean, of course, that we will leave the world of The Witcher. The Witcher is one or two franchises on which to build the future activities of the company. Today, unfortunately, I cannot reveal anything more. So it seems like The Witcher 4 will not even be called The Witcher 4. Thus, all bets are off, and the games is literally open to explore any storyline, with any character. What do we know that CD Projekt Red already has a relatively clear concept? Who will be the main character in The Witcher 4? After finishing The Witcher 3, Geralt's story is pretty much over, no matter which of the 40 endings you got. With this in mind, the fact that CD Projekt Red already confirmed The Witcher 3 to be the end of the trilogy, we do believe that Geralt will not be a part of The Witcher 4, at least not as a playable protagonist. Here's what the game's senior writer had to say on the matter. I think good stories must have an ending. You cannot extend them indefinitely. And we felt that Geralt has had such an amazing experience, and his saga is already so long and complex that like, this seemed like a good point to think about an appropriate finale of his story. Fact is, Geralt is in retirement, and deservedly so. Maybe The Witcher 4 will introduce a time skip, and he'll play the part of the wise old guru. But that's probably about the extent of his enrollment. As far as Siri goes, well, depending on what ending you choose, she's not an option. 
Since the world of The Witcher has so many characters and there's so much to choose from, it's most likely that CD Projekt Red will introduce us to a new protagonist of the franchise. Besides, with Geralt's story over, and such an influx of new players, the next Witcher game is the perfect opportunity to start fresh, and give the franchise a whole new makeup to let it soar to new heights. We could easily see The Witcher getting the God of War treatment except that we will probably see a different protagonist rather than a change in age wand. Still, this is all speculation, and only time will tell what City Project Red truly has in store for us. Whatever it is, it better not turn out like Cyberpunk.